Watch me make this drawing of Cerise Hood for the letter C. Good morning, people of the internet. Today I bring you this drawing of Cerise Hood for the letter C. I thought about drawing Cinderella, because she is probably one of my all-time favorite characters on the letter C, but then I realized that that would be too similar to, to Waffles series. Because, as you all know, probably, I got inspired to make this series by drawing with Waffles, an amazing artist, and if you haven't checked her out yet, you definitely should. So, I got the inspiration to make the alphabetical drawing series from her, and I felt that if I drew same characters at her as her, it would just be copying, and I didn't want that, because I did sort of steal her idea. Or, I mean, yeah, I basically did steal her idea. And I'm open about, and I'm honest about that. Like, yes, I got this idea from Drawing with Waffles, and I was incredibly inspired by her. But I felt like if I do the same thing as her, then that's just copying straight off, and it's not my own thing. Even if Cinderella is a character I like, I'm not going to draw her for letter C, because I feel that that's too familiar. Familiar. Fam I can't speak. I hope you all know that. Uh, so I drew Cerise Hood instead, because she is also one of my favorite characters on the letter C. So if you don't know who Cerise Hood is, then you're probably no dork. <laughs> Cerise Hood is a character from Ever After High, which is this show, Mattel made, which is basically just Australian dolls. It's like... Monster High, but with storybook characters, fairy tale characters. I made drawings about this in the past on my channel, so you all know that I like Air After High, and I'm going to be honest about that. It's not a phenomenal show, phenomenon, the phenomenal show, but it's fun. I like it, and the art style is okay, and I, but like it's it's a fun show. It's a lot of pretty colors, and you you can't help but be inspired by the show. So, in the show, Cerise Hood is one of my favorite characters because she is not having any of people's bullshit. She's just like, I mean, she's she's like shy because you know her dad's the big bad wolf and all, and she has a secret. But she's cool. She's like, she doesn't take any shit, and that is great. Plus, her design is really, really like my style. I want her clothes in real life. Like, I would kill to have <laughs> that cape. It's so awesome, I love it. And I try to do a more painterly style in the beginning because I'm trying to do more like painter style. The easiest thing for me is to do line art and then color and all that. But I feel like I want to evolve and I want to do like more detailed, uh, difficult work. So I try to do a painterly style in the beginning, as you could see, for Cerise, but then I just gave up and I decided to do line art and all that jazz. I try I really try to do more more stuff lately that isn't line art and isn't black colours and stuff, but it's uh, difficult to start a new thing. And if you can hear like some something smashing against it's I'm uh, banging my leg against my uh, desk drawer because I have too much energy. Oh, Oh yeah, and as you can see here with the plaid that I do for her shirt, uh, I didn't draw the plaid because I was lazy. But I looked at it for a while and was like, what is wrong with that? I can't understand, like, what did I do wrong? Why doesn't it look good? And I realized it's because the squares just go straight down instead of, like, contour contouring, contouring to her body. I don't know what that word is. Instead of, like, you know, being following the curves of her, of her body, which real flannel does and I had to fix that, so I think I fixed that a bit later. Um, but I do like doing like a painterly style over line art. Like I try to shade sort of painterly. painterly. Uh, yeah, I think you can see here that I, yeah, I twisted and turned it a bit and it looks way better. Uh, I think, I'm, if I'm just all over the place, I'm really sorry, I haven't eaten lunch yet, so I'm just like, <laughs> hunger. Um, I really do like this drawing of the research and I'm actually proud of how it turned out because I haven't really tried doing a bunch of like sunlight stuff and a bunch of environments and yeah, 
Oh, and as you can see, I planned to do like a C out of the tree branches in the beginning, but then I just did a C of tree branches overhead, which turned out way better. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!